Oh no, it got worse. It got worse. Toronto Raptors in the quarter provided confidential information to betters. Bro, how do you screw up the bag this upset. bad? Good evening, YouTube. We are back. Uh, Hi. Yes, I know it's been a while. We have been frantically, frantically coming up with new and exciting ways to benefit your entertainment. Thank you for all the comments, by the way, on our last videos. We truly do appreciate all the comments we left had on our last 35 video. 35 new subscribers, thanks to you guys. And we would like to shout out Kevin. Kevin! You're amazing because you are our first premium subscriber. Ooh, you're number one. He is number one in our hearts until you are. So yeah. take over his spot and so premium like, subscribe. Like, subscribe. Hit that premium subscribe button if you can. You and know. also, feel free to follow us on socials. My Instagram will be at the bottom of this screen right mm -hmm. here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Or maybe it'll be over there. Or maybe okay. it'll be over there. Yeah. I yeah. don't know. We'll see. Whatever our humble leader Yusue does with his editing technology. Ooh. Ooh. Anyways, on to the video. We come to you. Hot off the press from our boat. We we are located in Toronto. And our Toronto Raptors. Our beloved, horrible Toronto Raptors. Lead for Brooklyn. 320 to go. <laughs> With the tankathon. Was it intentional? Was it intentional? Who knows? Why tank in an absolutely shit draft class? That's what I want to know. Masai, what do you have up your sleeve? Anyways, we now go live to the breaking news. It has to be good news, right? What could it be? Waj react. Oh no, it got worse. <laughs> it got worse. Toronto Raptors forward Jonte Porter has been banned from the NBA for life. The league for life. The NBA said the Porter provided confidential information to betters. Bro, how do you screw up the bag this bad? Bet on NBA games. So, whoa, this is a pretty significant oh consequence here. What message is the league trying to send? So the thing is, that, uh, I read up on this any as soon as it dropped. gambling for players in he this plays league. three bets and not just players on himself to and lose. lots of people in the nba and they were all parlays and he lost and he lost each information and i think the message is not you, just about john t porter his but contract about everybody was what? in this league like and grand? you know you no, talk to teams and agents and whatever his contract was he lost it for john a grand porter total of twenty thousand dollar profit you have made it to the, the nba what is Silver, your problem uh, made an example of porter but this is still an ongoing investigation. Point is, is that uh, certainly federal law enforcement if you're going to drop the bag this, like that, uh, in the league make sure you get a bag. This you know? Make sure open, you have a bag but, to drop. Uh, listen, we now are guess what? Where we are you're immersed in imagine gambling, all the people you've let down. The arenas, family that was supporting you. Uh, the family media, that was depending on, on you. Own, your mom. Uh, social media feeds. I don't and know if the dad is there, but our Toronto Raptors community. I know. This is just absolutely all of this like today, I, hey i was, see that John I was looking for somebody to cheer for and you were one of the guys exactly uh, you know? it's certainly a, a damning revelation so, yeah. well you know what first of all i just want to say one thing i blame fred van vliet for this uh, because yeah. when that little mm, went to say bet on yourself all the rookies on the team apparently took it very, very <laughs> literally. That well, is not well, what well, he meant. Uh, well, that I thought it meant just work hard and like, you know, let the hard work speak for itself. No, type the, deal. no, it apparently means that you bet on yourself to do horrible because then, honestly, I admire his thinking for this. It means you can willingly underperform and possibly get rewarded for it. Yeah, by losing all Porter. three bets you placed and letting your associate know that you're going to place a $56,000 bet that winds up getting over a million dollars, mind you. Yep. Which got immediately flagged. Like, this isn't you right. Know, you know there was someone at DraftKings just being like, Jonte Porter flagged. under two for a 80000 yeah, just like, we'll take your money if it loses, but if it wins, 
you know, we'll, we'll be suspicious. <laughs> you know? So. Well, speaking from a DJ and gambler, truly, truly an inspiration oh, yeah. to us all. John oh, yeah. Porter, we at Studio B21 salute you for your stupidity. Yeah, that's absolutely <laughs> stupid. <laughs> so what's this mean for the Raptors? I'm just glad we don't have to give up our draft pick for it as punishment. Yeah. Because we had, and I mean, let's be honest, we cleared up a little bit of cap space as well with him being banned, so... <laughs> But he Clay Thompson to the Raptors with the cap oh. space. Oh, he did shit oh. it up last night. 0 for ten. It's something we could use. That that sounds like a Raptor. Come on, the team that the team that tore your ACL in the finals. Ooh, I think I think it's a match made in heaven. Yeah. What do you guys think about this scenario? We look forward to seeing your comments, and we hope once again. You guys stay sexy. Have a beautiful, beautiful like and subscribe. Day. Like and subscribe. And we'll see you again next time. Have a great day, guys.